Hi guys and welcome to my uh, latest video. This video is going to be for the listlabelship.com um, application. Um, it's, it's basically a quick way that you can print off your FBA barcodes um, very quickly and easily and without having to take a screenshot of every single uh, barcode. So it's basically just a quick way. Basically, um, if you go to listlabelship.com um, you can sign up there. It's uh, five dollars a month to to have this service, or three pounds a month in actual uh, British pounds. Um, so it's not very expensive at all, and it, and it's a really good, um, helpful service, if, especially if you're doing a lot of FBA and you're using a Dymo or a compatible um, label printer um, to print off your FBA barcodes. Um, so I'll get into it. Uh, this is basically the home page. Um, once you've sort of logged in and you've got like a login and you've signed up and you've subscribed, uh, you want to go um, to support and then to the setup instructions. Um, step one is to install the add-on, which will it's like you can either use Firefox or Chrome, um, and then you just I, I you select the Chrome add-on here. And it will take you to the list label ship, uh, basically the application, and you can install that. I've I've already installed that, so I don't need to install it again. Um, and then then you have to download the Dymo software. Uh, if you have a Dymo printer or if you're Zebra, then you have to download this other one. But I would I recommend you get a Dymo. Um, it's the best label printer for FBA, I find. Um, then on step three, you want to go to configure. Once you've got the Dymo software, you want to go to this configure page. Um, basically, I've already configured this. Uh, I have a Dymo label writer 450. The label type is 30334, which is the 50, I think it's 57 by 32 millimeters uh, labels. And then I put one click print, no. So it's it's very easy. You just have to select through this um, configuration, and it'll show you. So if you go Dymo, uh, it, just, it tells you if you've got your software installed. You select your 450. You select what um, label you want, and whether you want a one-click print. I would recommend saying no to the one-click print. Um, so basically, if I go back here, and then basically you can test the label if you just. Um, Click the barcode icon, which will be here, just at the top right-hand corner, listlabelship.com. It, it will print out a barcode for you. But now, once you've got that all installed and it's tested, and you've tested your barcode and it has printed out correctly, so here you are in your FBA inbound workflow. Um, you're just going to send and replenish an inventory. Um, so you set your quantity here and click continue and prepare products we can continue past that as well and this is label products so now that we uh we have all the um labels ready to print we're just going to click this button here which is the listlabelship.com button which will then once we've clicked that it says 34 labels generated and as you can see we have 34 total labels 34 so we have 34 labels, so we will print the 34 labels that we want for our shipment. We just click print labels, and then here we go. It will print out every single label for our shipment. As you can hear, that's the actual uh, Dymo 440 printing away there. And it's printing out all of them in one go. So I don't have to individually select every single one. It's a really, really great tool. And really really one that you should use i really highly recommend it. it will save you a lot of time and it's just a great tool it'll take a little while to actually print them all out but it's a lot quicker than having to individually select your barcode and then individually print it out <laughs> There we go, now it's actually done, and then we just have to label it all up, uh, put the box on, and then print out the labels 
for the box and send it off to FBA. So uh, hope you liked that video and I'll um, hopefully come out with some more videos in the next couple of weeks. Thanks very much, guys. See you later.